Go on, load. danger zone. You're about to get a horn to the gut. flat oh my gosh I, it's but ugh. i can't even do it yeah you gotta lay down you got your butt up there I, well i know but god dang i can't get over that lip <laughs> okay here i go do you know how long it would take to get through this cave okay so i could do it but i have to pull Come on, myself through pull through nope <laughs> to see Seth Bullock's grave thinking that it was gonna be an easy walk yeah not so much I'm gonna show you what we just had to come up to get to this lone grave of Seth Bullock so this is the top we're heading down now look at the houses see way down there that's where we started that's Deadwood way down there well we rode up part of it so again, thank God we're going down this time. This was a pretty steep incline. Of course, it probably doesn't look very steep on the video, but it is, believe me. It's the road out of Deadwood. It's probably where that gal from the covered wagon got killed by the Indians. So then after we walked all the way up there to the Seth Bullet grave, you come back through the cemetery gates and then down the hill and Wild Bill and Calamity Jane are buried a little bit further down. So I hope that Timothy Oliphant appreciates my effort that I did for him as his portrayal of Seth Bullock in Deadwood. I actually wanted to lay down and just have my final resting place up there because I almost died on that hike because it was so steep. But it's over, so now we're gonna go and look at the rest of the graves. Victim of the assassin, Jack McCall. Cowardly assassin. That's what she said.
So all the way up at the top, 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 top of that is where Bullock's Grave is. So we had to go all the way up that hill. Though the placard said it was only 775 feet yeah. in elevation. I think it's a lie. More like 3,783.